The Network and Sharing Center enables you to view the status of your active networks. You can see here in the taskbar that there is a problem with the network. If I right click this and click Open Network and Sharing Center, I get here. Notice it says you are not currently connected to any networks. I can click Troubleshoot Problems and work through the various wizards that are applicable. Here I can't connect to the internet so I'll click Next. The Network and Sharing Center and these troubleshooting uh, options can do lots of things for you that you probably wouldn't want to do by yourself. For instance, releasing and renewing the IP address, resetting adapter settings, or maybe even uncovering something as simple as a disconnected Ethernet cable that you don't know about. Here's one option right here. Plug an Ethernet cable into this computer. Well, you know what? I'm not worried about an Ethernet cable. In fact, I don't even want to use an Ethernet cable. I want to use wi wireless, so this isn't the problem right here. So I'm going to choose skip this step. And look, it says, well, the Wi-Fi adapter is disabled. So this is a repair that requires administrator approval. So I'll click administrator. It's going to work through fixing these problems, collecting results, resolving the problem. We'll wait for this to get finished. And look down here. You can see that I now have internet access and that the Wi-Fi adapter that was disabled has now been automatically enabled. This is a common problem because sometimes net books and laptops have little buttons on the function keys or maybe even on the side if they're old that disable those wireless network adapters and that can be a kind of a difficult problem to resolve if you're not familiar with it.